Molly Special Special. It was a blustery day on the island of Sodor. Thomas was excited. He was on his way to meet a new engine called Molly. She was waiting as he pulled into the yard. Molly was bright yellow. She had great big wheels and a shiny funnel. She looked very smart. Hello, Thomas puffed cheerfully. Hello, Molly chuffed back, but Molly looked sad. What's the matter? asked Thomas. Emily laughed at me because I have to take empty trucks to the coaling plant, Molly puffed sadly. I want to take full trucks like a really useful engine. This made Thomas feel sad. How can I help Molly feel important? he thought to himself. Then he saw some tarpaulin flapping in the wind. This gave Thomas an idea. Molly reversed the empty trucks into a siding. Thomas asked Molly's driver to cover her trucks with a tarpaulin. With your trucks covered up, no one will know they are empty, puffed Thomas. We can make everyone think you're carrying a special delivery. Then I will feel important, Molly chuffed cheerfully. Later, when Thomas saw Emily at the station, he told her all about Molly's special. What is it? asked Emily. Not telling, Thomas puffed. But it's the most special, special of all. And every time Thomas saw another engine, he told them all about Molly's special, special. Soon, all the engines were talking about Molly's special. They were excited, except Gordon. It won't be as important as my express, Gordon huffed. Molly's special is much more important than the express, puffed Thomas. And you'll see it tonight at Abbey Station. But then Thomas was worried. How can I make Molly's trucks look even more special than Gordon's express? He wondered. Later that evening, Thomas saw a station master lighting lanterns. This gave him another idea. Can I borrow your lanterns? Thomas puffed to the station master. Of course, the station master replied. Soon Thomas's trucks were filled with the lanterns, and he puffed away to find Molly. Soon Molly's trucks were decorated with the beautiful lanterns. She was taking the trucks to the coaling plant for a very important job. Your trucks look very special now, puffed Thomas. You must go through Abbey Station. Lots of engines will be there to see you. The lanterns on Molly's trucks twinkled like stars in the night. When Thomas and Molly arrived at Abbey Station, Emily, Percy and Gordon were waiting. Percy gasped. She looks magnificent, exclaimed Emily. And for the first time since she'd been on Sodor, Molly felt special. But not for long. A strong gust of wind blew one of the tarpaulins in the air. Oh no, gasped Thomas. Now everyone could see there was nothing inside. Those trucks are empty. Gordon huffed. I knew it couldn't be as important as the express. So there isn't a special special, Percy puffed sadly. Molly felt silly and not very important at all. So she puffed away as fast as she could. Thomas felt very bad. Just then, the fat controller called the station master. And the station master came to see Thomas. There are lots of engines waiting at the coaling plant. They're waiting for Molly's trucks. Oh no, moaned Thomas. I've got to find Molly quickly. <laughs> 
Molly had stopped in a siding. She looked very sad. I'm sorry I made you look silly, puffed Thomas, but they are waiting for your empty trucks at the coaling plant. But I've nearly run out of coal, moaned Molly. Don't worry, puffed Thomas. I can help you get there. So Thomas pushed and Molly pulled. Thomas and Molly worked together and they arrived at the coaling plant in no time at all. There were lots of engines waiting for them. They needed the empty trucks to start their nighttime deliveries. Your empty trucks were important after all, puffed Thomas. Molly felt so proud it made her axles tingle. We need even more trucks, chuffed Henry. I'll get them, Molly chuffed cheerfully. And I'll help, puffed Thomas. Molly filled up with more coal, then Molly and Thomas raced back to the yard. They collected some more empty trucks and they puffed quickly away. Gordon was stopped at a junction. His signal had turned to red. Out of the way, puffed Molly. Empty trucks coming through. You see, laughed Thomas. Sometimes empty trucks are more important than your express. Gordon's face went as red as the signal. And Molly felt more special than special.